time has come for change from a distribution manager to a wide-eyed adventurer. Click here to subscribe. Maya Condeos Muchachos. Yeah, man. Well, I have to say, when these cars get past, I know I look silly with my bandana on. Anyway, just coming through that tunnel there, you can see the sea, you know, and it's been a really hot day, been inland. So I was glad to see the sea. You know, I know there's gonna be towns and villages around. I know I'm gonna not get stuck out in the middle of nowhere for a drink or... I know I'm gonna get cheered. So I just, I love being near the sea. I feel safe, I feel safe on the coastal roads. Um, that's not to say I won't adventure out into the mainland, but I do feel, um, you know, safe. I'm gonna say the say. So that's a good sign for me because I was really hot. Okay, bye Condeo. So hungry. Didn't have any evening meal last night. I, mean, I just thought I'd pack the prunes. <laughs> pack the prunes and some nuts. So <clears throat> I've been up early. No, no, I haven't been up early. I've been lying. And a nice shower. And now I'm just looking for some breakfast. I need a coffee. That looked like the breakfast place to you. 
So my breakfast just came. Cheese sandwich, coffee. I guess when you're cycling really, you can eat what you want, you know. I've lost some weight, which I'm really grateful for. <clears throat> but anyway, I'm in Marbella. Looking around here. There's always, li there's always little movies going on. So you've got these workers. He was in the way with his van. So there's a, but they're all saying very friendly and how the nature of that. Oh, grazie. Oh, he's not coming here. <laughs> That's the waiter who brought my nice coffee. Um, so not much to say really, just a chilled out morning in Marbella. Got the day off. Do a bit of planning maybe because uh, I want to get, do I really want to go to Gibraltar because um, I really want to get on my way to Portugal. I haven't said that, you know, Gibraltar is Gibraltar, isn't it? So maybe I'll have to go, try the British flag there. We'll wait and see. I'm just going to carry on watching the movies that are around me. Hello, it's me again in Marbella. Just everywhere, every corner, around every corner is a nice little pretty little square and lots of people here. I hope you see it's alright. Lots of people here. It's very nice, isn't it? It's definitely worth a visit. Definitely worth a bit of visit to Mar Marbella. I'm surprised. Well, I don't know why I'm surprised, but it's very really nice. Obviously it's Christmas, so these Christmas decorations are up. Very nice. I'm actually looking for a supermarket to have to buy some uh, food. But restaurants look nice and for November it's very busy isn't it? Not bad for November. So I'm trying to avoid the chips and chicken because I'm on a diet. So we won't do that. I would definitely come here for a visit. Again. With my wife. Lots of clothes shops. Not that I'm bothered. I thought I'm a bit overdressed, aren't I really? I've just got the stuff on the cycling. <laughs> Turn right onto Plaza Costa Off my shirt. It's only it's one shirt I've got. I brought one shirt. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I've got turn left here. Eh? Oh, yes. Well, it's just shops, isn't it? I mean, I'm a bloke, mate, so I'm not that interested in like shops. But, you know, it's a really nice place. Nice, nice for some uh, girls to look at clothes, you know. I like the pots on the wall though. Oh, that hat, I like that hat though. 
Should I get that hat? No, I'll blow off when I'm saying. Queda más feo que no se vea nada. Yeah, but you can see, I mean, they're not where there was a lot of tourists, but, but it's quite quiet around the back streets. These restaurants are a bit empty here, and I guess in the summer they're going to be packed. Love all of that, there's plenty to look at here, isn't there? Definitely worth a visit. I know I've said it like, three, four times now, so paint myself. Yeah. Okay, I've gone off route again. So we're gonna go back this way. Bye.